Today we're going to be looking at the United Cutlery shoulder holster knife. For those of you who are not familiar with this, let me first explain one of the cool features other than the obvious shoulder holster part. This is a trench knife. Now a trench knife is designed to have a blade that leads into a handle that either in this case is cast metal around the blade or in the case of our previous review the blade and the handle are all one piece in this case like I said it's cast metal so you've got metal here and you've got a nice blade so the knife has an overall length of about nine and a half inches the handle itself is cast metal the blade however is 420 steel so it's not going to be as hard and not going to retain an edge as nice as some other steels however it is highly rust resistant the blade length is five inches and you're looking at about fifteen to twenty five dollars for this depending on where you look for it now the biggest issue with knives like these where there's some sort of a rig for it is how comfortable is this going to be if you're wearing this on a daily basis so figuratively speaking, I took it for a test drive. I rode with it in the car. I also walked around in public with it underneath my jacket. Nobody noticed. It was nice and slim. I had one instance where it came unclipped. However, I was sitting in a chair leaning backward and kind of stretching awkwardly, and that caused it to unclip. However, for casual use, it wasn't a problem. So let's go test this out. So the first thing we're going to test is how well the handle holds up, just if you wanted to punch someone. So as you can see, it definitely left its mark. I have no clue where that came from. So as far as punching someone, not a problem. It'll hold up just fine. All right, let's do another test. OK, so the next thing we're going to do we're just going to do a simple slash test just to make sure the blade will actually perform. So as you can see, just with a glancing blow, it cuts through. Pretty much any knife is going to, but just for the sake of being thorough, we still wanted to test that to make sure it'll work. Let's do another test. So we've done the punch test, we've done the slash test, now we're just going to do a simple stab test. So the last part that we're going to test is the durability of the construction of the handle. Unlike the M-Tech knuckle knife that we tested last time, this is not all one solid piece, so the handle is cast metal. So we just want to make sure that if you're going to be punching a harder surface than a human being, it's going to hold up and do the trick. So, got gloves, jacket, safety glasses, going to make sure that None of this goes anywhere but on the tarp we've put down. Let's get to it. One, two, three. So I think the M-Tech did a little bit better job of protecting the knuckles. Still, not bad considering I was punching a quarter inch of glass. So this is what you're going to see in terms of deformation, scuffing, scratching, dents. Any damage that's going to happen to the handle is going to be kind of like this if you're punching a harder surface. Remember this is cast metal, not 440C steel like the M-Tech. So you are going to have a softer metal here which is not going to hold up as well, but considering that was a quarter inch of glass that we just punched, not a problem really. I mean if you're not willing to get your gear dirty and scuffed up. What's the point in having it? All right. Thanks for watching. This is Destroyer signing off. Here in the Destroyer Education Network, we get a lot of opportunities to test out different products and find out if they're really all they're cracked up to be. These are products that we want to make sure will actually work out in the field and won't break down when you need them most. So if you're looking for gear that's going to be reliable 
and will work properly and won't give out on you take a look at the den gear store a lot of the products that we've reviewed are also offered on our website just go to www.destroyer.net and click on the link that says buy den gear and that will take you to our website which has a lot of great products ranging from knives to optics different gun accessories tactical gear survival gear you name it 